Introduction to Information Security and ISMS Information security, also known as InfoSec by some, refers to the rules or guidelines to protect not only physical but also digital information. It includes establishing and implementing a set of organizational processes that will protect business information assets, regardless of how that information is created or whether it is in transit, being processed, or at rest. Like it or not, any organization can become the target of cybersecurity attacks. An Information Security Management System, or ISMS, describes and determines how an organization deals with information security and privacy. It helps an organization recognize and address the threats and opportunities around any relevant information and related assets that protect it from possible security breaches and defend it from interference if and when they do happen. So what are the benefits of having and implementing an ISMS in an organization? Here are a few. It helps you secure your information by being aligned to an international standard. It boosts your resilience to cyber attacks. It helps your organization respond to developing physical and digital security threats. It improves organizational culture by having organization-wide security controls. Most importantly, it protects the confidentiality of information within your organization. To give you a better idea, here are some examples of security data breaches in 2020. The first one involves technology powerhouse Microsoft. In January 2020, Microsoft revealed that an internal customer support database on which the company stored anonymized user analytics was accidentally exposed online. Over 250 million customer records covering 14 years were exposed on the internet without any password protection. The said data breach leaked email addresses, IP addresses, and other details stored in the database. Yikes! Another is Facebook's data breach. In April 2020, there were 267 million Facebook profiles that surfaced up for sale on the dark web for less than $600. Yup, you heard that right. The profiles were traced back to a data leak discovered in December, but with further PII or personally identifiable information, including phone numbers and email addresses. The disclosed information would allow cyber criminals to conduct spear phishing operations designed to collect user passwords through fake email campaigns or SMS texts disguised as official communications from Facebook. One more example is the very famous Zoom data breach. It was also in April of last year when stay-at-home setups were implemented and the use of video conferencing apps rose in demand with Zoom being the primary beneficiary of this increased demand. As most organizations turn to Zoom, cyber attackers were able to penetrate the credentials of over 500,000 Zoom accounts and posted them for sale on the dark web for as low as $0.02 each. And the reason for this breach? Users using very weak and recycled passwords. The trend of recycling passwords gave the hackers easy access to the many new accounts created by hundreds of thousands of individuals who saw nothing wrong with reusing their pets' names for their passwords. Zoom reacted by hiring intelligence firms to trace these password dumps and shut down thousands of websites designed to trick users into downloading malware or providing their credentials. So you see, even big and famous organizations that invest in information security are not safe from cyber attacks. Now let's move on to the real deal. The ISO 27001-2013 Information Security Management System Standard. 